Hey guys, how are we doing today? So I first want to start off just by saying um, I'm sorry that it's been so long since I've done my last video. I told you guys it would be about a week. Unfortunately, it wasn't. Some things kind of made a different turn, so just wasn't able to get up my video, this video, as soon as I wanted to. But anyways, on to the video. As you can see, I'm standing outside my, my door to my room. So it just basically has the O on the outside. Now, the layout of my room hasn't changed. Just a lot of things around, the walls, the paintings, stuff like that. So. I will go on in and show you guys what's going on. So, obviously, as you can see, I painted my room gray. Everything's still exactly where it was. All the stuff off the walls has been taken down. So now it's more just kind of the gray with the white roof, just like you'd see in a Oakley store or a vault. Uh, bedding still the same. This is actually pretty cool. A new pickup that I got the Oakley Bob sign. I'm not sure if a lot of you guys know about that, but I actually have it hooked up to my light switch. So when it comes on, when I flip my light switch, the um, I, the actual picture lights up. It's a light box. So as you can see down there, it says Oakley, dedication to purpose beyond reason. Just really cool piece of artwork. I was really super pumped to pick up. This actually is supposed to hang on the wall, but it's so heavy. I just haven't figured out how I'm going to hang it. It's supposed to hang from the roof or the, sorry, the ceiling, but that's just not, not going to work out. I don't know how I'm going to do it. So that was another reason my video was kind of delayed was because I was trying to figure out how to hang it and I just thought I made you guys wait too long. So anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this light on right here. Just so that kind of makes the whole room go crazy. So I'm gonna cut that back off. But anyway, just kind of going around my room. I know um, a lot of the stuff, last time you guys saw my Oakley case, it actually had a lot of stuff hanging off the side of it and there was stuff up, up on top of it. And I kind of had to do some reevaluating in the sense of it, that wasn't Oakley. Oakley is a clean style when you look at it you know when you go in the stores there are nothing on top of the cases it never looks cluttered and the way I was displaying my stuff before it was cluttered and I had stuff all the way along the top of the the ceiling up there and it was just taped up you just have a big Oakley sign right there that was just kind of tacked up on the wall and it just it looked you know it just didn't look Oakley and that's really how I wanted my room to look was just kind of the clean style Unfortunately, as much stuff as I have, I don't have enough display cases or enough room just to leave stuff only in the case. So unfortunately, I did have to go ahead and put stuff on top. But it is what it is. I think it looks cool. So up on top, you have the Minute Machine display, um, a pair of top coats, and then just stuff. Uh, half jacket, I think is what that is. Lens display and a frame uh, picture of my girlfriend and I. So just kind of some cool stuff. I'm really not going to go too much into the cases. Um, it's kind of you know rolling up here. Have some couple new pieces in this particular case right here, the grapefruit dispatch. Then I have some of the newer, I guess not newer, but just some of the carbon fiber collection right there, over the top, 12 gauge David Flores. You know just that kind of stuff. Picked I did I was able to pick up a new belt, the gray one with the green icon. It's pretty cool. It's just kind of some stuff right there. You know, another thing I, I just didn't really show you, I just kind of clicked into it, but my cases are actually hooked up to this remote right here. I'm not sure if you can see it. So, which is really cool because when at night, when I need the light, I can just press it on, off, you know, on or off. I can really do whatever I want to. And then this case over here actually does the same thing. So, thought that was cool. So I'll go ahead and turn them both on. So I know that just kind of looks a lot more clean. The case still looks totally jam-packed and really doesn't reflect Oakley that much. I just simply don't have the extra display room. So there's my double wide right there. Then we have the back seat of my Tahoe with one of my icon packs. I wanted to do some kind of some kind of something with all my backpacks. I've got three of them. I was going to try and hang them on the walls, but it just it just is not going to work out. Not in this room. Now this was the only thing that I was seriously really not happy with the way this turned out. I unfortunately wasn't able to do anything with it. I tried to run the wires and tried to hide them, but you know you can obviously see the wires right there. So I was kind of disappointed in that, but I did have a really cool Sean White sign I was able to kind of put there to kind of mask the wires, but they're still there. So I just kind of, I got this piece of uh, furniture from my old house in Alabama that was just an all black table. So you have my RX lens box, you have some keys right there, my laptop, my iPhone, iPod, that kind of stuff right there. And then um, that's the cable box to actually control the TV. And as you can see right now, I'm actually playing the Blade movie. So that's pretty cool. Um, up here, this is actually a pair of shoes that I picked up. Uh, I picked them up actually to wear them and stuff. And I just got them and I was like, man, those are just too cool to wear. So I just, I never wore them. So I just put them up there. I thought they looked cool. 
So going on down to the radar case, pretty much, pretty much all radars now. Um, I think I've actually changed the setup a little bit maybe since the last time I've showed you guys, but just all my different radars, you know, different colorways, that kind of stuff. Just a little ugly sign in the back. And then this might be different, I'm not sure. It's been so long since I've done a collection update. Just different color radars. You've got the pink, retina burn. Then you have the staple radar, have the Livestrong, um, Ichiro Suzuki, and then um, the antifreeze. Going down, this is just a custom shelf. It's really not anything in particular, it's just all custom stuff. I think this is actually a new pair of flak jackets uh, back left with the blue ear socks. So I think those are new. Um, and then my transformer shelf, this has never changed. It's always stayed the same. And then this right here. So I think there has been some collection, just some kind of shift some stuff around. Like I said, I tried to, I wanted to make it look more Oakley. That was kind of the, the thought around the whole new room design is that stuff was looking cluttered and it started to, you know, just started to really look out of control and it wasn't, it wasn't necessary. So I kind of got some stuff taken under, under control and kind of, kind of wound back my collection a little bit. So sorry I haven't been doing collection updates or I haven't been doing any kind of updates at all. I've just been really busy with working and Christmas time. And I'm sure all you guys know how that is and just trying to stay alive and still trying to do some videos, I guess, here and there. But like I said, I'm sorry it's been so long since I've done my last video. I'll try and um, update as much as I possibly can. So in case I don't talk to you guys before Christmas, hope everybody has a safe and Merry Christmas. And I guess I'll talk to you guys later. All right, bye.